Today, no more keyboard. We're going to code with only our voice. Add import default capital react from react. So there's this app called Serenade and it looks pretty cool. We're going to use it today to code with just our voice. It looks like it works with several different languages. So we're going to go through the tutorial and then we're actually going to build an app with it. All right, so Serenade can control many other items. So you've got editors like Atom, VS Code, IntelliJ, PyCharm, uh, WebStorm, and then you've got terminals, Hyper, iTerm2, and Chrome. And then it supports all these different languages, Python, Java, JavaScript, TypeScript, C, C++, Dart, Kotlin, HTML, CSS, and SAS. So go ahead and download it if you want to give it a try as well. It's completely free. And by the way, this video is not sponsored by Serenade. All right, so I downloaded the app and installed it. So it looks like there are several different tutorials that we can go through. Java, JavaScript, Python. Let's start with the JavaScript basics. So it says, click the red button above to start Serenade and say next. All right, so click that. Next. Okay, open your editor, make sure that it has focus. Next. Create a new file and save it as Serenade. All right, so we're going to create a new file here, serenade.js. Okay, and then it says, say next. Insert import random. Undo. Next. So we're going to recreate this function in the next part of the tutorial. Next, add function factorial. Add parameter number. Add if number equals zero. Add return one. Add else. Add return number times factorial of number minus one. Line nine. Add let value equals factorial of five. Next. Wow. All right, I'm going to hit stop listening because every time I talk, it's, it's listening to what I say. So it says your editor should now have a simple class as a starting point. We're going to add a super class, write a new method, and perform a simple refactor. All right, so here we go. Next. Add extends account. Go to line one. Delete line. Second method. Delete second parameter. Copy method. End of method paste. Previous line four times. Go to deposit. Change word to withdraw. Change plus to minus. Start of line. Start of file. New line below. Add all caps min balance equals negative 100. Repeat. Line 23, move assignment value to function open account. What? Style file. Next. Wow. Okay. So there's a lot of key words that you have to remember, it seems like, but this, this is super, super cool. Okay, your editor should now have a function that's supposed to calculate if a number is prime, but it doesn't work yet. Let's fix that together with voice. Okay, so next, add if number less than one. Add return false. Delete next if. 
previous line. Add let i equals 2. Add while i less than number. Add if number mod i equals 0. Add return true. End of file, add prime of 3. Add print prime of 5. Add assert of prime of 7. Previous character. Insert double equals true. Next. This thing's pretty cool. All right, let's try some navigation. Let's see what this does. All right, next. Open your editor. Da, 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 da. Okay, next. All right, we need a pie. So let's add serenade. Okay. Next. Next. Go to map. Go to next map. Go to line three. Go to next line. Go to previous line. Next word. First word. Word two. Next three words. End of line. Start of class. Third method. End of second parameter. Return value. Wow. This thing's pretty slick. All right, let's look at the text formatting next. All right. Next. Next. Add let value equals five. Add let second value. Insert equals value plus one. Add let my string equals quotes hello. Add let my array equals brackets one comma two. Add let snake my second string equals double quotes. Add let Pascal my third string. That's cool. Add camel value escape plus equals zero. Add const heading equals tag h1. Insert capital welcome to my page. Add const callback equals lambda of response. Huh. End of file. Insert output equals double quotes plus message. New line. Type output space equals space double quotes plus message double quotes. Two. Interesting. Okay, let's do the JavaScript Express. Next. Next. Got that. Next. Add const express equals require of quotes express. Add const app equals express parens. Add const port equals 3000. New line. Undo. Next line. Add new line. Add app dot get of quotes slash. Of quotes slash. That's interesting. Add argument lambda of request comma response. 
add response.send of quotes index. Next line, add app.listen of port. Undo. Add app.listen of port. Add argument lambda. Add console.log of quotes listening. Two. So it looks like it tries to figure out what you're saying, but it gives you multiple options. So if it's not quite right, you can look there and say one, two, three, four, select the number of the option that is correct. But so far it's been pretty correct the first time. Line three, add app.use of express.static of quotes public. Add function current user. Add return braces. Two. Line 15, add new line. Add app.get of quotes slash API. Add argument lambda of request comma response. Add const user equals current user parens. Two. Pretty cool. All right, let's do some React. JavaScript React. Let's try that. Next. 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 Add import default capital React from React. Add new line. Add class shopping list. Add extends react.component. And we're going to do classes. Add constructor. Two. Add super of props. Add this.state equals braces. Two. Two. Add method render. Add const items equals this dot state dot items dot map of lambda item. Add return tag li. Insert braces item. New line. Undo. Next line. Add return tag div add tag h1 insert shopping list end of line add tag a insert create add attribute href equals quotes hash Add attribute on click equals braces e arrow this dot create parens. End of line. Add tag ul. Insert braces items. Two. Add this dot set state of braces. Two. Style file. Amazing. That's pretty crazy. So let's try out Chrome. Let's use the Chrome extension. So I do have the Chrome extension installed. There's a link here to install it if you don't have it already. Next. Focus Chrome. New tab. OpenStackOverflow.com. Click search. Type Python reverse string. Press enter. Oh, we've got a human verification here. I'm going to have to click this. All right. Click reverse a string in Python. 
it went to the article. Back. Show links. Click one. Close tab. Pretty cool. Okay, we're gonna try to build an entire application without using the keyboard at all. All right, we're gonna try to build a Vite React application and get it running. Let's try it. Press Control tilde. One. System npm init space at one word vite js slash app space dot. Not quite right. Eight. Enter. System serenade dash demo. Enter. Down. Down. Enter. Enter. System npm space i. Enter. Open app.js. One. Down. Down. Go to line 10. Go to line 16. Go to line 19. Select line. One. Delete. One. Type capital, this is really cool, period, space, capital, serenade helped me type this, period. Save. Press control tilde. One. System npm run dev. Enter. Okay, so now it's on. Okay, let's try this. Focus Chrome. New tab. Go to one word localhost colon 3000. One. Show links. One. One. Tab, space, 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 space 10 times, space 20 times. <laughs> oh, that's pretty awesome. All right, so that was really cool. Give Serenade a try if you want to rest your hands from typing, or especially for those with disabilities, it's very intuitive. Uh, again, it's free to download. Go give it a try. That's going to be it for this video. Like this video to help me out and subscribe if you haven't already for more videos like this.